guys, it's Amy and welcome to another episode of The Sims 4. In the last episode you saw that Amy and Josh who are now married have their own house now so they don't live with Sunday and Max. Which is kind of sad because I really miss Sunday and I really miss Max so I miss them living together and having a whole bunch of fun. But hang on, Josh, go back to bed. You'll have breakfast in a minute. <laughs> you don't have breakfast when you wake up, Puppet. Um, I think it's really important for Amy and Josh, now that they are married, to have their own place. Um, and then they can raise their own family and it'll all be really good. Oh, actually, it is five in the morning. Sorry, Josh. I thought it was like 10 o'clock at night. You can wake up and you can have food. Um, Amy, are you working today, my little cherub? I think she's actually awake. If I caught her just as she's waking. That's really strange. Look at that. She's literally just waking up. <laughs> okay, let's get Amy showered and get her going poopy. And Josh, I'm sorry, darling. I'm really sorry. Let's get you awake and you can serve some breakfast. Let's go ahead and do that. Ew. Uh, let's clean that up and serve some breakfast. So let's have some... What would be good? Eggs and toast today? There we go. All right, Josh. I'm sorry. Don't be mad. I'm sorry. Are you working today, Josh? Um... I don't even know. Where are you, darling? You are working in nine hours. What we need you to do is um, work on your piano skills. So we're going to do that once you've had breakfast and got ready. And um, Amy, how are you doing, sweetie? Oh, don't you are so cute and in love. I love them so much. Uh, don't burn the breakfast. Good job, Josh. Good job. Okay, Amy is... W oh, criminy. This just looks bad, doesn't it? Don't die. What are you doing, Josh, you crazy goose? Um, we kind of want Amy to, uh, we want a good work with her so we can get her another promotion. Um, so yeah, we're going to do that. Uh, Josh, are you actually eating? You're eating. So I really want you to, I don't know if I'm going to be able to get him to practice piano before we can get him showered because I'm going to be going to work any second now. So let's just make sure he is ready uh, for work. And then Amy, uh, once you're done, darling, we'll go to work with you, okay? Look how happy you are. Oh my gosh, you guys are the cutest couple. What, what is Josh doing? Seriously, I, I, I worry about that boy sometimes. I really do. I really want to change Josh's hair. I'm kind of bored of the blue. I think we should change it to a different color. Um, here we go. We're going to go to work with Amy and hope that we can get her another promotion. Let's do this. Okay, so here we are at another day of work. Look at this dude. His hair is on fire. Um, what we need to do is diagnose. Oh, no. Yeah, we need to run test find diagnosis, but we need to perform surgery on three patients. That's pretty intense. Uh, let's start over here, examine patient, and let's check your... Actually, no, because I'm guessing... Are you doing it, lady? No, you're not doing it. All right, so let's go and check your earlobes and see how your earlobes are doing. Um, okay, your earlobes seem to be pretty good. Uh, what else do we need to do? We need to swab you for a sample and take your temperature. So let's go um, back to examine, take temperature, and then we want to swab you for a sample. Um, I'm scared to perform surgery. It's something I'm really not that good at. <laughs> but hopefully we'll be a little bit better. Uh, we need to scan the body. So let's go ahead and scan your body. And then um, we need to analyze the patient's sample on this little machine over here. So let's go ahead and analyze the sample. And hopefully this lady will need surgery and I can perform it and not kill her. That'll be good. <laughs> yeah. Hey, get away from my patient. She's mine. Um, we need to um, examine her. No, we don't. We need to refer her for a treadmill test. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay, loves it. Uh, how are we doing? Can we diagnose her yet? We can give her a compelling diagnosis. Not quite what we need though. We need to have um, like a confirmed diagnosis. So let's log um, what we have found into the computer. And um, then let's check um, her eyes. Where did she go? Is it this one? I think it is. Um, let's examine your eyeballs, my little cherub. Let's go ahead and do that. Eyeballs are checked. Fantastic. Uh, what else do we need to do? Discuss general health and swab you. We've got a decent diagnosis. Uh, what is it? Uh, we've still only got three. We can't do it, guys. We, wait, what was that? Clubs? I don't even know. Um, we can talk to you about stuff, so let's talk to her, maybe she can give us some more information about what's wrong with her. Um, anything? Have we got it yet? Come on lady, we need to diagnose you! Oh, we can't even. We've done pretty much everything. Medical refer, let's refer her for an x-ray maybe, maybe that's when we'll know. 
Um, I know that's not one of my tasks, but I do need to find out what's up with her. Um, how you doing, lady? Uh, I don't know. It's Come on, we need to know what's wrong with you. Uh, the patient left. Tired of waiting for proper medical care. Patient has left. Well, I'm so sorry. I'm only one doctor. Seriously. All right. Um, now can we diagnose you, sweetheart? Compelling. All right. We've narrowed it down to two. So it's either bloaty head or a triple threat. So what else could we do now? Um, can we examine? Let's discuss health again. Okay. Awesome. What else can we do? Come on. There's got to be something. Uh, medical for her. Oh. I don't know. I don't know if we can do it, dudes. I think we may have to um, just go with it. Right, we've got bloaty head or triple threat. Is her head bloaty? I don't know. Um, let's just see if she has a triple threat. I don't even know if she does. Um, but we're going to see. Do you have triple threat? Okay, okay. I think you may do. Um, what can we do now? We need to treat you, don't we? Examine patient. Uh, treat patient with surgery. Okay, so we're gonna perform surgery. I don't know if this is the right diagnosis, but I hope so. Um, okay, so we need to give you surgery on the surgery table. I don't like the surgery. It's super gross. Look at it. All the blood and guts and stuff. Look, uh, there's a heart. Bye, heart. <laughs> I, don't, I hope she's okay. Poor lady. Well, we have got... Oh, no. Operating can be a bad diagnosis. Fail to cure Clara's ailment on surgery. This may not look good on her performance review. Oh no! As long as she doesn't die, I don't care about me. As long as the lady don't die. But we have performed one surgery, which is great. So I guess we just need to do some more and try and get some more um, points to get more surgery. So let's uh, do some more of this um, general health checks. And yeah, let's do it. Already we have a weak diagnosis available, which, what is that? Um, <laughs> I don't want to give surgery now because I'm going to get told off. Uh, let's just keep on doing some examinations on her. It's her again! She's back! That Clara lady! She's back, she's sick. So what was it? She doesn't have triple threat. That's what we do know because that was definitely the wrong diagnosis. I need to pee real bad. Um, so I better pee before I pee myself. Uh, let's go do that. Um, I don't I'll get to do any more surgery today. I only need to do two more surgeries though until I get the promotion, which is good. Um, exam results were unavailable. Oh, crime me. Okay, so I can't even do that. But time has pretty much run out, so there's no point actually doing it anymore. End of shift. We did get $1,700 though, so that's pretty good. Good day's job work thing done. Yeah. <laughs> so we are back home. Uh, what I think we need to do is have some dinner. Uh, let's have some... What is vegetarian that we could eat? Um, garlic noodles. We have that quite a lot, but I guess we could do that. Um, how are you feeling, Amy? You're pretty good. You haven't got much energy. Um, but what we'll do is um, we're going to have some food. We're going to have a little nap because today, if Josh is in a good mood... <laughs> uh, that's funny. If Josh is in a good mood, we are going to try um, and have a baby because I'm really excited to have babies. It's what I really want to do. Um, so let's eat some food. And then after that, we're going to just go over here and have a nap and just get a little bit of energy. In fact, we should probably buy like a little coffee machine as well just so we have that. Um, Josh, how are you feeling, Petal? Um, you need to pee once you get in. So go, no, 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 Josh, Joshy pants. Come here, go use the bathroom. Good job. And then I want you to come downstairs. And I want you to see how um, you and Amy get on if you're going to be in a good mood. <laughs> if you want to have baby time. Because I really want to be pregnant. I think it'll be so much fun. All right, let's go to Josh. And then um, let's be romantic with him and let's embrace him. Let's embrace our love for Josh. Look how cute they are. Ah, oh, they do look cute, don't they? Oh, I'm so in love with them, I cannot even. That's cute. Oh, are they going to kiss? Ah, oh, huggles. Loves it. Right, let's turn into Josh and um, become best friends. That's cute. Can we have more than one best friend on here? I don't know. Let's flirt a little. Hey, how you doing? How you doing? Ah, okay, Josh did not look too happy right there, I don't know why. Um, okay, what else could we do? Um, let's kiss her cheek, Josh. Let's be romantic. Ah, loves it. And then, um, what else could we do? Uh, I'm so excited. I want to have a baby! Um, is the option even here? Try for a baby! Okay, this is it. We could do it. We could try for a baby. Are we ready? This is a next step in our relationship. We're we gonna have babies. 
Oh my goodness, Josh wants to have babies! They're gonna do it! They're gonna have baby time! Okay, let's give them some privacy. We don't really wanna watch them uh, make babies. <laughs> let's do that. Um, Josh and Amy are woohooing for the first time. I kind of don't wanna witness that magical experience, but I'm happy because maybe then it's baby time. Well, it is baby time, um, clearly. She's feeling happy, which is good. Um, are they, are they finished? Uh, okay, I think they could be finished. So what we need to do now is Amy needs to go over here. Are they finished? I think they are, yeah, okay. Amy needs to go here and take a pregnancy test to see if she is pregnant. Yeah, okay. Go do it. Let's hope that we are preggers. <laughs> How romantic. Okay, are we pregnant? Oh, I'm not pregnant, no! I wanna be impregnated. Oh, I'm so gutted. That's okay though. Don't worry. Uh, Josh, why don't you go to sleep, sweetness? Um, go to bed. Oh, we could try again. Should we try again? Try for a baby with Amy. <laughs> Maybe it was like first time nerves. Oh no, Josh wants dinner. <laughs> you know, <laughs> he doesn't want to have baby time right now. He wants to have some dinner. All right, that's fine. Um, we could try just one more time just to see. Uh, no, no, Amy's asleep. She she's tired. All right, that's okay. Josh, you go to sleep. Um, what we could do though is I do believe Amy is off work tomorrow, so we could go to the spa. And apparently, there's like a fertility massage that we can get, um, which will basically mean we might be able to have twins or triplets or something. Um, and it will also give us more of a chance to get pregnant, I believe. Um, Amy's feeling great. Let's take a shower um, and go for pee pee. There we go. Good job. Shower and pee pee. Would you like to pee pee? Go pee pee. Loves it. Uh, Josh, how are you feeling? Do you want to wake up? <laughs> you want to try again for babies? I do want them to have babies. I really do. Um, Amy, come back. Let's see if you can try one more time before you go to the uh, baby clinic -y place. Um, let's go to romance um, and try for a baby. All right, let's do that. Okay. Do you want to? Okay, I don't want to see it. I don't want to see myself doing that. <laughs> Enjoy having baby time. Um, hopefully they will get pregnant. Um, are they doing it? Are they... Wow, Amy, Amy's asleep. That's pretty impressive. And now she's happy. Okay, she's happy egg. Loves it. Right, so Amy. Josh is really happy. That's so cute. Take a pregnancy test, Amy. Um, and then after that, we're going to go to the uh, spa to get a fertility massage. Massage? Massage. Um, massage. Mass I can't say it properly, I don't know why. I'm nervous, I want to be pregnant. Oh, I did, I'm pregnant! Amy is expecting there's going to be a new addition to this household. I'm pregnant! Josh! I'm pregnant, I'm so excited! Oh my goodness, how Josh? <laughs> ah, he's so happy, I think, is he? They look kind of happy. Oh my goodness, look! Look, look at my tummy! Oh, wow, that is so cool. Is she going to throw up? She seems like she's going to throw up. Okay, what we're going to do, Amy is pregnant, which is fantastic. Um, but we want to take a shower um, and go to the bathroom. Josh, you can actually uh, go over here and maybe serve some breakfast. Um, let's serve some French toast. Um, and then, yeah, we're going to get Amy to go to the spa to get the fertility massage. And then hopefully we can have maybe more than one baby, which will be super, super fun. Just saying. Another thing that we can do to um, make sure we have another child would be uh, we could buy a reward system thingy. Um, and we could buy, I think it's, I don't know if we have enough actually. Um, we could possibly have enough, I don't know, uh, fertile. Oh, we haven't got enough money for this. But if we had this, we would have a higher chance of twins or triplets. Maybe we can remember that next time. We have 2,585, uh, so we do need a little bit more before we do that. But let's go and see um, how Josh is doing with breakfast. Josh, you're going to be a daddy! Daddy Josh, I'm so super excited. Did you make breakfast yet, Josh? I don't know. Josh, did you? Um, I can't see if breakfast is around. Um, did you actually make breakfast? I thought you were serving breakfast. Alright, make a salad. Maybe that would be a good meal. Um, that's cute. And then Amy, how are you feeling? Are you still showing? Look, she's pregnant! She's got pregnancy and everything! Um, so you can have some food once- Oh, like, you're gonna eat your own food, that's fine. Um, okay, perfect. How are you feeling? Are you good? I don't know when I'm gonna actually give birth though, that's the weird thing. Like, it could be tomorrow, who knows. But she's having a lot of fun, which is good. 
I cannot believe how big I am already. Look at that. That's so weird. I, I, I just cannot. Okay, so what we're going to do now that Amy has eaten, we are going to go to the spa um, and uh, go and get a massage, which will be really cool. So here we are at the spa. Uh, what we need to do is go to one of these spa beds. Now, I've never done this before, so I don't really know what I'm doing, but hire a massage therapist. So let's go ahead and try that. And we want the um, fertility one. Um, can I even... A service hire. I, I missed what that said. What's it say? Um, okay, hide by Amy is on the way. All right, so let's go ahead and go and get massaged. Um, we can click on him um, and get a massage, and then we want a fertility massage, and hopefully we um, that will help us get uh, more babies. We could get twins or triplets. Who knows? Uh, but we're gonna try it anyway. Amy, where are you, darling? Petal, there we go, loves it. Oh, I've hired two <laughs> massage therapists. Sorry, Petal, I forgot. Maybe we can do it twice, who knows. Um, so you jump on there, Amy, and get your massage. There we go. Uh, Josh is off to work, which is good. This looks really relaxing, doesn't it? Oh, wow, loves it. Well, that was good. How do you feel, Amy? Does it feel nice? You feel inspired, which is good. What do all these mean? Um, you're eating for two. Um, oh my goodness, you're in the second trimester in 18 hours. Crimony. The blood is boiling from vitality and procreative energy. Now, I wonder what happens if we had two massages. Should we try it? <laughs> I don't know if that's a good thing or not, but let's uh, have another one and just see if that will improve our chances. I don't even know. Sunday is wondering if uh, I want to go out of the house and go and see her. I would love to, but I'm in the middle of something very important Sunday, but I'll invite Sunday over once we've done this. Um, God, this is so exciting. I cannot believe how big I am. I'm so pregnant. It's so weird. Uh, loves it. Enjoy it, Amy. Enjoy it, my little dear. Oh my goodness, you can actually do yoga? That's so cool, dude. I did not know that you could do yoga. That's amazing. I kind of like this spa. It's really cool, but we should probably be getting home in a second. How are you feeling, Amy? You feeling good? Oh my goodness, I can't believe it! I can't, it's so exciting. Loves it. What happens if I do yoga? Can I, shall we try it? Should we just pose? A greeting pose, let's just see what will happen. Um, come on, Amy, do, do, do a pose. Hi, <laughs> oh my goodness, you look adorable. <laughs> um, what, 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 what do we, what do we, what do we do? Uh, I don't even know, but she's just, um, Oh, she feels sick. <laughs> Amy's new skill in wellness will allow her to perform various yoga poses and meditate and give a massage. That's really cool, actually. Um, do um, a greeting pose again, I guess. There we go. Perfect. At least you've got a new skill. I'm pretty proud of you, Amy. Well done. Um, I don't think you're doing the greatest, but, you know, you're, you're trying, which is cool. Anyway. Oh, okay. I've captured a screenshot. Magical. Let's get on out of here and head back home um, so Josh um, and Amy can have a nice romantic night in. Um, so, oh, okay, wrong one. <laughs> Let's travel um, and travel back home. And here we are at home. Now, I don't know what I'm gonna do when, um, when it comes to work and this baby. Like, do I have to give up work or can I hire a nanny to look after the baby? I don't really know. Um, but I guess we should clean up a little bit and then let's check Amy and make sure that um, everything is good. Uh, let's just clean all this up, uh, clean it up. Let's check her. Uh, she needs to go to the bathroom. Uh, Max, I heard you have a secret admirer at the romance festival. Shall we go try and find him? I don't have a secret admirer, but that sounds fun. We should have gone to that festival. Next time, we'll go next time. Um, let's go on up here and getting me um, using the bathroom. Maybe she can have a little shower and then we should probably, uh, we don't need to go to sleep, that's okay. We can get Josh to come in when Josh comes home and they can have a nice little uh, romantic evening in. Josh can have a shower as well. Amy, why don't you, um, let's have you uh, being in a good fun mood. Why don't you play some games or something? You wanna you wanna watch TV? You can go ahead and do that. Good job, Amy. Good job. Well, that's pretty much it for today's episode, everybody. I hope you enjoyed it. I cannot believe how impregnated I am. Look at my belly. Look at it. It's humongous. <laughs> I have no idea when I'm gonna give birth. It might be next episode. Who knows? But yeah. Oh, Josh is naked. Bye, Josh. <laughs> Thank you guys so very much for watching. If you like this video don't forget to give it a big thumbs up support all of your favorite youtubers and give every video you like a thumbs up it helps us a lot 
And yeah, I love you guys. Thanks for watching again. Goodbye.